I don't hand it off to you. But awesome. All right, guys. So this is going to be the existing furnace. We are looking at 19 and 3 8 versus the new one is about 21 inches wide. You do have about two inches on the side going up to there. Coming back to this, you still have about an inch and a half to two. It might be just a little bit tight as you're running into this. Um, with this guy out and exposed, you guys should be able to go back a little bit further and then get it through this. So there's no issue. There's no rub. And be careful uh, with this. They do a really good job maintaining their house. So I just want to make sure we're not damaging or dinging anything. Um, from there, though, this is an 80,000 BTU furnace with a four-ton fan uh, with a four-ton coil up top. We will be matching that most likely um, after I do the heat loss calculation. Um, it sounds like that's really what they want mm -hmm. overall. Um, we do have two-inch going to three-inch PVC going out. The fresher intake is right off of the top of this guy. Um, we'll just do a gooseneck on the next one. And prefer, if you guys can, come out this side so we can still have access to the coil and everything. Uh, for maintenance purposes. You also have a three quarter inch drain line, uh, which Jeff, I'm gonna have you just point over here real quick. So you're gonna see the floor drain right over there. Um, that's where that three quarter inch line's running to. Um, and then I'm actually probably just gonna steal it real quick. <laughs> yeah. uh, back here guys, you have the intake or fresh air coming in for this area overall. Um, so we do have a fresh air exchange coming through. I'll hand it back to you, thank you. Um, with the cold air return drop on this side, guys, it is a 10 by 24, which is plenty of the size. Um, typically, we'll add in a base can to kind of help this guy breathe a bit better. Um, but due to the size of this cold air return drop, I'm not too worried about it. Um, I'll leave that up to, to you guys overall. We do have plenty of space. There is not a um, supply run right behind here. And then you're 69 inches to about here, but you have well over about 72 going all the way up here. So plenty of room to work with. Um, question I have for you, Jeff, is on this, is this pretty easy to change out your filter? Is that give you any trouble? Not really. No, okay. it's pretty easy. Wonderful. Then we'll keep that the same then for you. And it's a 20 by 25 by one filter rack and access panel right there, guys. And then you have the electrical for the system right there. Um, gas lines coming down right here and it has a new modern day shut off. So that's great. That'll also help them save money. Um, and I didn't mention this in the other video outside, but they do have a brand new thermostat that Jeff put on himself that we'd like to keep. So we're going to do that for them. And that's going to be basically everything that we're looking at guys. So thank you, sir. Okay.